Garrett Wilson with Mike White was even better than he was before with Zach Wilson. He ran 28 of 30 routes, clearly led that team in routes run. No one else ran more than 23. So they're looking at it right now, like the wide receiver coach is looking at it and saying, okay, this is the top wide receiver on the team. This guy is the guy who's going to play every play. And then we'll figure out how to work in the rest of you guys around him. Those are the guys I want on my team. So if I can go out and get Garrett Wilson right now, while you know he's got this connection with Mike White, he might be my top waiver end this week. I don't know about you guys. So I'm throwing the fact on there. And, you know, he's also a rookie, so shiny, exciting. Yeah, absolutely. This is exactly what you want to see. This progression for Garrett Wilson throughout the season is, is he's just fallen into this just like the best or like prototypical ideal season for rookie wide receivers. He's talented and I expect him to continue being talented going forward. So yeah, total fact. Does Mike White being the quarterback elevate or lower him for you rest of the season for fantasy? Neutral. Agreed. Neutral. Yeah. Man, all that love for Mike White, but it doesn't, it's not better for him than Zach Wilson was because the offense did look so. better with, with Mike White in there. Yeah, maybe yeah. mildly. Not like a Jalen Hurts to Gardner Minshew change where you're changing the type of quarterback and now all of a sudden different routes are in play. I think these guys do very similar things. So I like like Simon said, it's kind of an it's kind of a lateral change. Maybe lateral slightly up if he plays better, but 